Good job. Uh, you were the first person to get down to the stage, get the crowd hype. So that was definitely a plus. Um, you have a great voice. You showcased it at the beginning, and that was uh, good as well. So great job. Um, I agree. Um, I commend you on having the bravery to come down those stairs in those shoes. <laughs> um, but you worked it out, and I think you had the, the, the great stage presence that you need for a song like this. And um, I, I would just say um, work on connecting that deeper breath. Um, so that you can reach all those notes. I think you did a great job, though. Yeah, again, nice job. Uh, it must have taken a long time to time all of that at the beginning. Uh, nice, nice maintenance of the key. Nice work there. Getting all that. That's it's it's really hard for me to listen to you singing along with all of that going on, knowing it's a canned recording. So you did a nice job with that. That's tricky. Great confidence. Way to command the stage. Um, Keep working on intonation in some of those some of those runs there at the end. Really nice work. Thank you. Hi, Caitlin. Um, I thought you did a great job. Um, definitely a sassy song, and you did a great job performing it. It was fun, so good work. Sassy. Hey, Cats. We are here with the finalists from last year, Caitlin Duell, and we're here to ask you a couple of questions. So you did a song from the movie Burlesque with Christina Aguilera. What chose you to pick that song? What made you pick that song out of the many songs she performed in that performance? Um, well, I love the movie and I love Christina Aguilera. She really kind of gives me a vocal range that challenges me. Um, but out of the movie, that song really stood out to me because it's kind of her first um, performance as a vocalist in the in the movie. And she's so sassy and it's so much fun to really like get involved with the crowd and do that kind of thing with that kind of song. So that's awesome. So we noticed you went out in the crowd for some of it. Uh, how did it feel? How did the crowd interaction go? Do you think they played well with you? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I had a lot of sisters out here to support me, which was great. But being on stage is the happy place for me. So I love being able to get out and just involve myself within the crowd. It's like, it's just something, it's like a breath of fresh air for me to be out there and be in with them as well, so. Sisters, what do you mean? Um, I'm a Gamma Phi Beta. Um, so my sisters came out tonight to support me, which was really great. Okay, last question for this evening. So you are in K-State Seniors and you did K-State all last year. Are you following your passion here at K-State? I'm not studying my passion, I'm studying journalism. However, um, if I ever got a break in the music business, I would absolutely go with it. Music is something that I have loved my whole life. Um, and like I said, it's just, it's my happy place. It's what I enjoy doing. So um, I'm, not, I'm not necessarily studying to do that, but if someday the opportunity comes along, I will absolutely take it. Well, best of luck to you. Next up, we have Austin Narbrood and Danny Lucas. <laughs> 